since 1934, the Mountaineer has been the official mascot of West Virginia University. There have been 62 mascots in total, and only two have been female. Junior Darren Buslick believes she should be the third. Why can't a girl be a mountaineer? I, tell, I told him in my interview, I'm strong, I might not look like it, you know, I can be just as spirited, maybe even louder than those guys. And I don't think um, being a girl's never held me back from anything before, why should it hold me back from this? One of this year's finalists is Jonathan Kimball, WVU's current mountaineer. He says that the job wasn't easy to get, but now that he's recognized as the mascot, he'd love to be picked again. I've had a great experience this last year. Um, I've been able to work well with, with uh, the, the maniacs, different themes, and I love to be the Mountaineer. And I think I'll do even a better job next year as a Mountaineer. After filling out an application, the Mountaineer Honorary Society chooses 10 applicants. Those 10 go on to do an interview, and the final four selected get to try out at a WVU basketball game. It's come down to the final four, three males and one female. Vuslik was the only girl overall that applied this season. Though the list of mascots includes 60 men, the public relations major decided it was worth a shot. All I could think is I'll never know if I never try. And what a great opportunity to represent my school and my state that I love so much. What, what more of a PR job could I want? The winner will be announced March 9th at the men's basketball game against Iowa State. Alyssa Castellino, WVU Sports, Morgantown.